Hi, and welcome back to Managed Solution in the Techno Web Tech Series. I'm Janelle Mott, the Business Operations Manager here at Managed Solution. Today, we're going to go over how to open a shared mailbox, as well as kind of send a, a message from a shared mailbox. Um, you know, a lot of times, us technology people might create a mailbox for your group. Uh, you know, say it might be, um, you know, sales department or different technical departments or groups. Uh, and we said, okay, yeah, I'll just go ahead and, and open it up. Well, easier said than done, right? Technical people. So um, we're going to go ahead and show you how to easily open that up. So go ahead and follow along with me uh, on my desktop today. So you're gonna go down to Outlook and go ahead and um, open that up. Takes a little sec to load here. This is what happens when you have a large mailbox. And you are gonna go ahead and uh, you'll see over on uh, the left here, it's kind of defaulting to my uh, jmot at uh, managedsolution.com. Um, but you'll see over on the left column, I also have a, a couple more um, different mailboxes that are kind of listed over here. One is called the charitable request, or we had an old employee. Um, a lot of times we'll uh, create a shared mailbox for an old employee. That way um, you guys can have access to the license in Office 365 or access to the mailbox, and but not use the license. So it's a great way to um, you know give people access to a person's old mailbox. Um, so that way you would, could be able to click that there as well as I also have another mailbox, which is my online archive. But today we're gonna to go ahead and pull open the charitable request, and I'm gonna to go to the inbox there. And uh, you'll see right here, um, there's a client that had uh, emailed us here. I'm gonna go ahead and hit uh, reply. And it's going to pull open a mailbox here message. and. I could, um, you'll see right here the title, it says charitable requests. I actually don't wanna send it on the behalf of charitable requests because say this is a, a sales group and I wanna take the lead from that. Um, I could then send as myself. Um, that way I'm then taking kind of ownership of the, of the email instead of somebody else. Um, or if I want um, you know, for everyone to kind of see that, um, you know, uh, that there's a email mo a box there or kind of see what I reply to, I could keep it there. But if I want to respond as myself, you'll see that it changes from my email address. That's gonna be all for us today on the subject matter. Uh, don't forget to go to our website, www.managedsolution.com and go to the In the Techno Web Tech series and um, go ahead and uh, submit uh, and sign up for our newsletter. We'd love to hear from you, as well as don't be afraid to become part of our community and um, post things that you would like to see on how-to videos. Thanks again for joining us. Have a great day.